Could you give us a little background on Elvis's career around the time he was making foreign films like Lornitolog and El Cocinero? Hello. Uh, yes, in the early 70s, his career was down in the dumps. No great shakes for him. His health was failing. His legacy, who knew if he had one anymore? He had a six-film contract with MGM, but they wanted to renegotiate. They saw him as an embarrassment. They called him Rotund. They called him Bulbous. They called him Flatulent. Drug addled. It was then that Colonel Tom Parker makes a meeting and renegotiates for all of it. He gets all six films made for the foreign markets. It was like the first Lost in Translation. We're talking 1972. Lornita Log was one of the first ones made for the French market. It was a return to form for Elvis. He gets the girl, beats the bad guy, and sings the song. He's a graduate student in Florida studying the destruction of native habitat of birds in the Everglades. He then finds out about a theme park developer named Neil Frisbee, who is mowing down the natural space to build a Frisbee land. Full fresh. Bird Diploma, the theme to the movie, is a hit. It debuts at 36 on the Paris Match Index. Peugeot. All Parisians love it! Tous les jeux, tous les sons. Elvis is almost more famous than Jerry Lewis, the most favorite American. Bonjour le merde. Incredible. I think I need a bird diploma. That shit outside is my Scooby Doo. Then I need a bowl of porridge. Then I make sweet love to you Yeah, I make sweet love to you The cartoon man they call Neil Frisbee He wants to build a wonderland He's killing off all my flamingos I'll throw a wrench into his plan I'll throw a wrench into his plan And then I'll make sweet love to you 